Yo guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys the top 5 classes to dominate on shipment or just dominate after the new update 1.12. So, in today's video, I've got 5 of the best classes for you. I definitely recommend you guys giving them a go. And I definitely recommend you guys giving them a go on the new map, which is shipment. As you guys may know, it's a remake of the shipment from previous Call of Duties. Everyone's pretty excited about it. Um, if you guys have played it, make sure to go ahead and leave your, like, what do you think about it like leave your opinion down below of what you guys actually go ahead and think about this new map personally i think it's pretty good it's very different to the usual the spawns are absolutely everywhere and it's kind of a mess right now but i recommend you guys using these classes on this map because trust me these classes are going to make you absolutely dominate every single lobby now first up it's going to be the ak-47 class in my opinion this is probably one of the best assault rifles in the game and also one of the best weapons in the game in general it is a very very nice weapon it's got a lot of damage to it a lot of um a, a nice fire rate it's not got got much recoil on it it's got a very nice steady accuracy in my opinion and i just think it's very very powerful and very good and it has some unique attachments on it that makes this weapon extremely overpowered so i definitely recommend you guys giving this a go i'd just like to quickly mention as well um in all of my classes i pretty much use the same three attachments and i recommend you guys using these attachments if you are going to be playing on um shipment especially so as you guys can see i have eod i have ghost on and then i have battle hardened on now eod basically protects you from explosives and as you guys probably know if you have played shipment it is probably one of the maps with the most explosives just happening 24 7 everyone is chucking claymores on the floor everyone is chucking c4s around grenades around everyone is getting score streaks and everyone is also chucking around concussions smokes stuns and all that kind of stuff so battle hardened is really really going to help you out now i don't really recommend you guys using ghost too much on um this map because as you guys know it's a very very small map so there's not really much point in using ghost but that is what i would use if you are going to be playing any other map if you're going to be playing shipment though i recommend you guys using either kill chain or point man personally i would say kill chain is probably the best one because basically this allows you to stack your streaks up and basically if you get kills with uh, your streaks it counts towards your next streaks which is very very helpful anyway enough of that let's just get straight into these class up so the first one is obviously going to be the ak first up the attachment i like to use on this is the monolithic suppressor this increases my sound suppression and it also increases my damage range which is very very nice now it's not really needed on shipment uh, with extra damage range because obviously it's a very very small map so you don't really need this attachment with the extra damage range but i still recommend giving it a go because it's probably the best suppressor on the list Next up is going to be the 23 inch Romanian, I believe that's what it's called, but yeah, it's the last barrel you unlock, um, and this increases the damage range, bullet velocity, and recoil control, so this increases three different things to the weapon, and it's going to make it really, really good. It basically increases the recoil control and the range on this weapon, which is going to make it really good. Next up, though, is going to be the reflex sight now personally i recommend you guys using the cronan lp945 mini reflex sight that is my favorite sight in the game i use it on pretty much most of my weapons but that is just my opinion you guys can of course go ahead and use whatever sight you guys like to next up is going to be the skeleton stock this is going to make my aim walking movement speed a little bit quicker and also make my aim down sight speed a lot quicker as well which is very very helpful especially with this weapon it can be quite slow sometimes so having this extra speed on this weapon is very very helpful Next up is going to be the 74, I mean 75 round drum magazine. Now, it's completely up to you if you guys want to use this. You can, of course, go ahead and switch out the extra ammo for like a rear grip or a perk or something like that if you guys want to. But personally, I recommend using this, especially on shipment, because like I said, there's going to be a lot of people all the time. You're always going to be in action. So it's very, very nice to have a lot of bullets in your magazine. Um, I do strongly recommend you guys sticking it on. Next up is going to be the FAL. Personally, I absolutely love this weapon. I think it's one of the most underrated weapons in the game. I'm not, I don't see many people talking about it or many people making videos on it. In my opinion, it is actually one of the best weapons in the game if you use it correctly and if you have a good trigger finger. Now, obviously, that is going to be one of the most important things with this weapon is having a good trigger finger. Anyway, let's get into the class setup. So, as you guys can see, once again, I, I like to use the monolithic suppressor. I use this suppressor on pretty much most of my classes, just because, in my opinion, it's one of the best ones. It increases your range, and it also increases your um, sound suppression, which is very, very good. Next up, though, is going to be the... Um, XRK Marksman 
barrel increases your damage range bullet velocity and recoil control once again just like the last one and then as you guys can see i have this same reflex sight on once again and like i said before it's probably my favorite reflex sight in the game and it's completely up to you if you want to use this you can of course go ahead and use whatever sight you guys like to everyone has a different opinion and everyone has a different favorite sight that you like next up though is the 30 round magazines i definitely recommend you guys giving this a go because without this i believe you only get like 15 bullets or 20 bullets something like that so there's not much bullets in this um weapon i do strongly recommend you guys sticking on that extended mags and then i recommend you guys sticking on the ranger 4 grip to basically help you have a better um bit of a better accuracy with this weapon because the recoil on this weapon and the accuracy with this weapon is very very important you have to hit every single one of your shots on target or if you miss like one bullet in a gunfight then you can um lose that gunfight quite oftenly so hitting all your targets and hitting all your bullets on targets is very very important as you guys can see it's the same attachments and the same i mean same perks and lethals and tacticals and all of that kind of stuff next up though is going to be the m91 once again as you guys can see i have the monolithic suppressor on um, which increases the sound suppression once again and it also increases the damage range which is very very helpful i do strongly recommend you guys using this suppressor on pretty much every single weapon that you use that's what i do literally every single weapon i use i always use that suppressor on it if i'm going to use one because in my opinion it's very very helpful next up i'm going to be using the m91 infantry this basically just makes this weapon have a faster aim down sight speed and faster movement speed which is very very helpful because it is an lmg and as you guys know with an lmg they are quite slow weapons so it's very very helpful to have a um, attachment that speeds up the weapon at all as, um, if you have any attachment that speeds up at all it's gonna make the weapon a lot better as you guys can see once again i have that same sight on you guys can use whatever sight you guys like to next up is going to be the no stock attachment now as you guys can see the reason i use this is because it increases my movement speed once again and it also increases my aim down sight speed once again which is very very helpful because you guys are going to be able to move a lot quicker with this weapon and you guys are going to be able to win a lot more gunfights and then once again i have the 150 round Amaz uh, magazine on this weapon so i do really recommend you guys sticking that on especially on shipment you guys aren't gonna have to reload that much honestly as well on shipment if you use pretty much any lmg on that game on that map sorry then yeah you guys are just gonna be absolutely dominating with these um with these classes literally any lmg on that weapon i only thought i'd include one lmg in this video otherwise if it was a video um just for classes for shipment they probably would have all been just lmgs because lmgs is what everyone uses on shipment um so i do recommend you guys using that lmg or using the pkm or the mg or something like that um the sa87 is terrible by the way so don't use it but all the other lmgs make sure to go ahead and give them a go on the shipment and you guys will probably be dominating every single lobby anyway next up it's going to be the mp7 class now this is one of the classes if you guys want to go ahead and rush around a little bit as you guys can see first of all i had the barrel attachment on and then i had the no stock attachment on as well all the attachments I use on this weapon basically just increase the movement speed and make this weapon a little bit faster and also decrease the uh, recoil on this weapon. As you guys can see the stippled grip tape here, aim down sight speed is a plus and also sprint to fire speed is also a plus so you guys are going to be able to aim in very very quickly and shoot people very very quickly as well and it's going to help you win a lot of gunfights. Next up of course is going to be the um, extended mags. You've probably noticed a bit of a trend here on basically every single weapon. I always use extended mags because why would you not want more bullets? More bullets will get you more kills. It'll make you die less. It'll make you get more kill streaks. All of that kind of stuff. So it's very, very helpful. Anyway, last up is the operator foregrip, which reduces the recoil control. Now, this weapon already has like next to zero recoil. So with this attachment, it's going to make it very, very good. Anyway, the last attachment on today's video is going to be the mp5 one now this is probably my favorite uh, weapon and my favorite class at the moment um just because of this one attachment in pacific as you guys can see it's called the subsonic integral suppressor it is the last suppressor you actually unlock 
and it's it's just amazing you get four pros of this weapon which are very very nice and you only get one little con which increases i mean it decreases the bullet velocity which really doesn't matter that basically just means that the range on this weapon is a little bit lower than normal but it's still it's not really noticeable in my opinion um, but as you guys can see the pros are sound suppression which will basically make your weapon suppressed which is very nice you're not going to have no visible uh, tracers which basically means the enemies can't see your bullet stream Faster aim down sight speed and the enemy skulls when you kill them they're not going to be visible which is very very good so you guys are going to be super stealthy with that attachment and you guys can also aim down the sight a lot quicker as well so it's very very nice. Next up is the stock attachment which increases my aim down sight speed I recommend you guys giving this a go um, it's going to make you aim down the sight very very quickly especially with the uh, the first attachment I just showed you then and then once again uh, as you guys can see the stippled grip tape also increases your aim down sight speed and it also increases your sprint to fire speed so this weapon is basically just going to be a super stealthy super fast like class it's super super good it's like a little ninja class you're going to be very very quick and you're going to be very very quiet and you're just going to be able to kill a lot of people and not really being seen next up though is the operator foregrip once again this this, this basically increases my recoil control anyway that is it for today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed one last thing by the way if you guys are playing shipment i recommend you guys using claymores they will basically get you free kills anyway thank you for watching make sure to go ahead and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video peace